Hello, my beautiful sweets. Sweet Sadie J coming back at you. Hope everyone's having a wonderful day, afternoon, evening, whatever time you're watching this video. Welcome back to my channel, Sweet Sadie J TV. Thank you all so very, very much for all the love and support you show my channel. I have a hodgepodge of a Dollar Tree haul that I did with the 10% off on Sunday, October 9th. I went to about three different stores, you guys, and yeah. Everything was kind of like wonk, wonk, wonk. <laughs> so I just got what I what I found, but nothing really like exciting. Zazazing. Y'all know what I mean. So anywho, without further ado, let's jump right into this Dollar Tree haul. Okay, my sweets. Like I said, I just have a hodgepodge of stuff. I really didn't find anything fantabulous. Um, anything that might have been on my wish list. No. I went to three different stores on Sunday, October 9th. I had three coupons. I did not go to Family Dollars, only Dollar Tree. But I'm going to show you guys the few little things that I found that were new to me or repurchases. So first of all, we found this little turkey um, tea light holder. It's so freaking cute. I had to have that to put with my Thanksgiving um, decorations. I just thought it was so cute. You know, you can always judge this up. You can spray paint it a different color if you want. But I like the color just the way it is. I like those cute little legs on it. And I did put one little tea light in it. And this thing tries to chip my nails when I try to put it on. So it's really, really cute. Uh, I tried the pumpkin one and it didn't fit. But the regular ones, they fit in there. And it just illuminates the background a little bit. Isn't that cute? So I did get that and I'm going to turn this off and sorry y'all, these things try to chip my nails sometimes. That's why I was telling you about the on and off buttons on some of these lights. So I got the little turkey and um, one of my sisters, um, YouTube sisters, my girl Sonia from um, Dollar Tree Brooklyn Girl. She asked me if I found any more of the disco lights. Would I pick her up one? So I did find them, and this is for her. I'm looking for something else for her unless she finds it first. But I did get her one of those <laughs> those fun disco lights. So, and you know, they take, um, what do they take? Three, yeah, that requires three um, AAA batteries. But these things are fun, y'all. You know, <laughs> we used to play with those back in the day. And this is a Wonk 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 product. I bought this party light bulb, 60 watts in the purple, and I tried it in my lamp, and it is so dull and so dim. I guess that's the way it's supposed to be for Halloween, but it does not light up very much at all. So I might take this back and exchange it for something else, because I think that's a waste of my $1.25. But if you guys are having a party, a Halloween party of some type, and you want to, you know dark in the room, it'll be okay. So y'all know I don't celebrate Halloween. I just wasn't raised to celebrate Halloween. Anyway, let's um, move on to the next one. Okay, like I said, this is just a hodgepodge of stuff. I really did like this Sure and Fresh Feminine, Feminine Wash, the Intimate Cleansing Formula, supp supply scented, and it's a 7.5 fluid ounce. So while I had the 10% coupons off, I went ahead and I got two two more of these. I really like it. It's fine. It's just fine. So I was like, okay, I didn't like that other one, but I like this one. And then the next item I found was these cute little makeup sponges. I think that's what they call blender sponges. And they're so cute. I kind of wish the decoration was actually on the, um, the uh, sponges, but they're not. But y'all know I had to get the purple. <laughs> Have a nice day. Yeah, looks like this. So cute. I just thought that was so darling. Of course, like I said, it's not 
the picture is not on the sponge itself. These are blender sponges, latex free. Um, I'm trying to see if it's a Greenbrier product. I don't have my glasses on. Uh, of course, made in China. I can't really see who this is from. It doesn't say Greenbrier. Um, but this one is the yellow one. And this is wild and cute. <laughs> I thought that was too cute to leave it. So I did get two of these, even though y'all know I don't like putting stuff on my skin. I put a little makeup around my eyes since I bought that Maybelline um, eyeliner. I've been trying to use it and I've had absolutely no problems with it making my eyes tear. This is what I used to wear back in the day and I, I don't know why I couldn't remember it, but I'm digging it. And thanks to Tiffany's passion, I put her in my link before she bought those pencils and I went out looking for them. Thank you, Tiffany. Thank you so much because I'm loving it. Okay, moving right along. Oh, I don't need any more of these, but I just could not help it, you guys. This, this, um, These scrunchies were so cute. They look like glitter, but they don't have any glitter in them. They're called Five Rainbow Scrunchies, and they're from Gimme. And I thought five for $1.25 was right up my alley. Y'all know I'm all about the bonus buys. <laughs> But look at those colors. That drew me in right there. But they are so pretty. They got both my favorite colors in there. So I could not leave their, leave them behind. Dollar Tree is just booming with scrunchies and barrettes and clips and bobby pins. Wow. It's unbelievable all the stuff that they're coming out with right now. Okay. The next items is they did come out with some new LA color stuff. And y'all know. I'm stepping outside the box because I've never really cared for LA Colors products. They just don't work for me. I don't know why, but anywho, I did venture out. They had a whole end cap full of the new LA Colors um, stuff. So I got, this is called <clears throat> Sass, and this is a lip crayon, and it says gives lips a full defined look. I don't, I don't need that. <laughs> Y'all can clearly see my lips are naturally full. Thank you, Lord. <laughs> but this is what it looks like. I thought I would venture out, like I said, and try it. If I'm not courageous enough to try it, these will be great stocking stuffers for Christmas for someone else who does really, really wear, you know, makeup. Then I got these two shadow sticks. And I don't know what I was thinking because anytime I use a creamy shadow, um, eyeshadow on my eyelids, my eyelids will break out in like a, a thousand little tiny bumps. I can't use the cream. So I don't know what I'm, I was thinking when I saw these. But again, great gifts for someone else who can wear this. This one is the Shadow Stick Blue Gleam. And it looks like this. So cute. I was digging at blue, y'all. I was like, ooh, look at that. So this one looks like that. And then this one is a kind of like a neutral. It's called Glycerine. Glycerine. <laughs> all by LA Colors. And they all say new. So I said, well, when I got home and I was looking at it, I said, ugh, this is a um, brighten your eyes. This one is brighten your eyes, but it's a cream. So I'll try it one time, and if it don't work, or I might not try it at all, and just, like I said, put it in someone else's gift. Okay. Okay, y'all know I didn't need these, right? But they were so darn cute. I've seen them floating around on other people's um, hauls, and I just got them. Again, if I don't utilize them here in my home, I will definitely give them away. But these are the home decor. They open up like this. And I just thought that was so darn cute. I was like, oh, look at that. It says, family makes this house a home. Isn't that beautiful? I just love that. I could not leave it. I had to get it. And then they had this one that says, there's no place like home. And this one is mine. The other one will be gift, but this one is definitely mine. There is no place like home. Y'all hear me say it all the time. This is my happy place. I love it. It just looks like this on the back. And it just says, Table Decor, Greenbrier International. So, I thought that was so, so darn cute. So, I got those two. 
And along with home decor, I finally found the uh, card holder. Now, I didn't really need this, but y'all know. You know, you just got to get it. it. And that's exactly what it's called, the black and white card holder. So I have my cards with my logo and stuff on it. So I figured, eh, I'll put them in there. It's still, my cards are still in the box. So $1.25, uh, they had all the rest of the stuff that went with this set, but I didn't need any of it. So I just got that. And I've purchased these in the past, and I love them. These are the, again, two for one. <laughs> the bonus jot button envelopes, and I have about three of them down here in my file box and i love them because you get the smaller one and then you get the larger one and y'all know i went right for that one uh-huh <laughs> that purple and it just says two piece button envelope um by jot and then it gives you the dimensions you know on the bottom you want to see that you want to stop the and uh screenshot that so i just thought that was beautiful and then this is just gorgeous. This is the same type of thing, but in that zebra kind of lime green print. And I just thought that was beautiful. And like I always say, anything that comes in a bonus, I'm there. <laughs> so I got those two. Okay, coming up, the last few items of this haul, you guys. Okay, my sweets, I don't know if any of you remember when I got those um, two gift boxes that I found several months ago. One was a fire truck and the other one was a school bus. Well, when I went out shopping this weekend, last weekend, I found the gift box with the police car on it. And I think these are so darn cute. Save you on some wrapping paper. You could just, you know... Put your little ribbon around it with a little name tag or ornament on it. And it's so cute. It's on all sides. And I love these gift boxes. So I got the police one. And then this one reminds me of my sister's um, old job that she used to do. She literally drove these big trucks. So it's like a big dumpster construction um, truck. And I, look how big this is. They did come in different sizes. You know, but I just grabbed what I saw. So I got this one, and it looks like this. That's the back, I guess. Well, nothing on this side, but I just thought they were so darn cute. I said I got to have them. I don't know what I'm going to do with them, but I got to have them. All right. Then I went down to the stationary side, and I found some more crayons. And this one, I also found the... Um, Crayola Chalk, the multicolor. It doesn't really give you much information. It just says Crayola Chalk, solid, consistent color in a strong stick that resists breaking. Now, they did have the box of all white ones, too, but y'all know me and my multicolors, love, love, love. Of course, I'm just going to be donating this to the kids or whatever. So, I got that Crayola 12 for Chalk. And then I found some more of the little 8-packs. They have so many different 8-packs um, of the Crayola crayons. I think they have a confetti. I don't know if I got that one or not. But I found the Una, Una crayons. And it says 8 crayons. And all Crayolas say non-toxic. This says each box of Crayola Pick Your Pack crayons is color-coordinated to take your imagination on a wild adventure, collect them all. So this one looks like that. And I thought they were so cute. And then you look on the back, you can see the colors. Darling, right? So I got those. And then I found some, the, the, okay, sorry, y'all. <laughs> I found the eight pack of the bold and bright construction paper crayon. So this is great for um, coloring on construction paper. It says great color on a variety on a variety of papers, specially formulated to create vivid color on a dark paper, used on construction paper, paper bags, and even cardboard boxes. So I thought that was great. That was so neat. And again, you get eight of them and they look like that. And they don't have the colors on it, but I was having a hard time reading it because the background was green. But I thought they were so cute. 
But this last item that I have for you guys today, I thought was so darling. I started to get multiple packs of these, but then I said, well, it comes with six in a pack, so I can just break this up and put a little pack in each gift bag. Because when I donate to the church or the orphanage, I like to make up the gift bags, the individual gift bags. So this is Dr. Seuss crayons, y'all. Four box per um, four crayons per box, non-toxic. I thought these were so darn cute. Look at that. Oh my god, green eggs and ham, <laughs> cat in the hat. I love Dr. Seuss. This is from my childhood, you guys. Look at that. I thought they were so cute. Look at the small um, boxes that come in there. Then they have the characters on the back. I'm like, for $1.25, six boxes of four. And, you know, most kids don't need more than four. And they come with the um, all red, yellow, green, and purple. Red, yellow, green, and purple. So they're all the same color. A red, yellow, green, and purple. I thought that was so cute. But that is it for today, you guys. I do have a rather sizable uh, food haul. Nothing exciting. I didn't find anything new. A couple of repurchases, but I'll have that coming up for you later. Um, yeah, that's it for today. Love, peace, and happiness. Sweet Sadie J coming back at you. Remember, guys, be kind to each other. The world is big enough for us all. I love you all so very, very much. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And everyone, have a blessed day. Bye, guys.